Hey, it's Friday! That's why I'm wearing this Hawaiian shirt. Because I'm a big fat party animal. Road game tonight. Houston, game number four. Will Love and Scola fight? Will they kiss? I have a lot of comments to get to. Thank God. Because I got nothing otherwise. I'm sure I had some stuff, but I forgot it. What else is new? I don't know if you can tell, but the fan is still going on in the background. Because the Lenovo guy, sorry, the IBM guy, IBM owns Lenovo. The IBM tech uh, was in some other part of the state and wasn't going to make it to my part of the state in time. He said he'd be back Monday. And I forgot Monday's a holiday, so hopefully he won't really be back until Tuesday. Otherwise, nobody will let him into the building. Be advised, because Monday is President's Day, you will not see me recording one of these from here on Monday, because I won't be here. I will be home, in bed, probably watching an illegally downloaded copy of the Elimination Chamber. It's now 5.38. Thank you, Taco Bell. And the current temperature is 32 degrees. It is actually 31.9, just below freezing, which means driving home will be treacherous. Actually, no. It has to be a little cooler for it to be treacherous. I'm going to try real hard to get to the grocery store tonight. They owe me five bucks from their contest, but I have to give them the thing that says you owe me five bucks, and that's going to expire tomorrow, so i got to take care of it today. Um... This stuff is really important. But I'm going to use that five bucks to buy frozen pizza, which we will have for dinner tonight, maybe, probably. I actually haven't planned that far ahead. But that's what I'm thinking right now. Because I am starving because I skipped breakfast and I skipped lunch. And it was a bad idea. Actually, I did have a peanut bar. Planters, double peanut, something or other. So when my face breaks out this weekend, you know it's because I had too much peanut butter and peanuts. But I got here at 8.30 for my 8.30 call. Actually, I got here at 8.35. There's, it turns out there's actual traffic in the 8 hour that I, I just don't know about. So I was a little late thanks to traffic. But I was going to reward myself by going to McDonald's and getting some breakfast. My favorite, the steak bagel with cheese. But I just... Didn't get up the uh, to go drive to McDonald's, and I just didn't feel like ingesting that many calories. So instead, I had hardly any, which I guess is good for me. But I'm so hungry now. I'll make up for it tonight. Have some alcohol or something. Yeah, that's a good plan. So yesterday, when I was talking about how I didn't have any comments, I was totally wrong because I did have a comment on the video from the day before, which would be Wednesday's video. And ironically enough, it was from a man known only as The Fan. So when yesterday when I said, when I labeled the tweet with my video, the sound of my biggest fan, Elfano probably thought I was talking about him, although I didn't realize it at the time, because I was actually talking about the fan that's going on next to my laptop. But it's just one of those neat, juxtapositions that happens. Alfano speaks his own language and he dots it with a lot of punctuation and aesthetic flair. So when I read it, I'm really not getting across the whole vibe of it. So you may have to go to YouTube and look at the comment yourself. But he says, I swear this was called I Ate Too Much Candy yesterday. The tweet was probably called I Ate Too Much Candy, and I did. I got some candy for Valentine's Day. It came in this beautiful bag. It was on my desk when I arrived on Wednesday because I took Tuesday off. And I ate practically all of it on Wednesday. So, LOL. Doing this for my Blackberry, so I hope it works. It did work. All the talk about hair reminded me of Katara from Mortal Kombat when she killed her prey with her hair ponytail. I actually know what you're talking about, which I'm shocked because I wasn't a big Mortal Kombat thing. But yeah, she had the kind of whoosh, and she would 
Yep. Which then reminded me of KMFDM's Mortal Kombat soundtrack song. Excellent. Which then reminded me of Giorgio Moreau's remix with KMFDM. That's right, Juke Joint Dezebel. Which then reminded me of you, because I am Mr. Ultimate Giorgio fan. Thank you, Elfano. How's that for a stream of CRZ hair talk consciousness? That was pretty good. You got you got a lot of points in between, but you ended up on me. As Flea would say, six degrees of rider Facon, except it would be CRZ Facon, I guess. Flea, are you watching these? Send me a sign. Alfano managed to use 499 of his 500 characters. Really amazing. And it's as if he planned it out himself. Although, using a BlackBerry, I know there's not a lot of ease with which you can go back and edit stuff, so... That's good stuff, especially with all of the bracket smiley faces. I responded saying, I wish I'd seen this comment about 20 minutes ago. I'll respond tomorrow, which is today. He also wrote back, no worries. I wasn't sure what, quite where to comment, so if there's a better place, just let me know. This is fine. This is great. Everybody can see it. You can do it on Facebook, but I hate Facebook. Facebook now is everyone posting photos that aren't photos. They're words. Are there those six graphics of people's jobs? Or it's that picture of Santorum and that picture of Osama bin Laden. Yeah. So, I hate Facebook. But I will post these to Facebook. And you can respond on Facebook. As did uh, somebody. I know I got a comment. I haven't looked at it yet. It's from Cheryl. Have you talked about your hair yet? Yes, you missed it. I don't have the stamina this evening to watch yesterday's video. Can I get notes? No, you cannot. Go back and watch yesterday's video. You'll find 10 minutes somewhere. I believe in you, Cheryl. I know it can happen. Getting out of the W. Da, 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 da. Are the Zimmerman boys terminating the family tree, or do you have plans for a CRZ Jr.? Next question. When you get staggeredly posting threads about China's porn videos, what's your immediate reaction? Yay, more referrals coming. Wondering, will this finally knock off the Gail Kim Naked thread? I hate service. And then you go back and see it wasn't him who started the thread. That's pretty close, especially with the way the thread was titled. A lot of you people fancy yourself New York Post uh, headline writers, and you're not. But, yeah, uh, fascinating. China has another sex video. Do we really need to know that? Well, somebody needed to know it, or we wouldn't have started the thread. So, Staggerly is good enough to respond to my YouTube videos, so I can't begrudge him too much for starting yet another China sex video thread, which I haven't watched and won't watch and don't care. But it shoots tomorrow. I'm very excited about that. Thank you. Service, I'm just glad I'm not the only one around here keeping up with people doing porn. That's what I want the W to be known for. People keeping up with porn and posting about it on that message board. Speaking of porn, and you saying that you would answer most any question, what's your favorite kind of porn video? Um, Japanese. When looking at your bookmarks, what's the first porn site listed? I have no porn sites bookmarked. Are you kidding me? Come on. Don't be pretending you don't have any. You're a male, and that's what we do. No. They're all up here, baby. What would it take to get you to just shave your head? Cancer. You'd probably get a decent price for selling all that hair to a wig maker. I hope that there never comes a time in my life when I'm so hard up for cash that I have to sell my hair. My beautiful, beautiful hair. That's all I have. Too much hair here, though. i got to shave. Maybe I'll... I don't know. Stagger Lee... The aforementioned Stagger Lee says, I'll make you a deal, CRZ. You cut all your hair off and donate it to charity. I'll grow mine out for one year and then donate it. I've been shaving my head since 92. Do it for the cancer victims. Oh, no, I already said cancer. Well, no. There are all sorts of ways to be charitably charitable. And I'm only interested in ones that do not involve my hair. Although I will grow a beard when the time comes. That time is not now. I will shave before Tuesday. Come back and see what it looks like. That's it. I'm out of time. Our 10 minutes is up. We made it through another week. Thank you. Thank you for continuing to watch. Please comment. 
you can see how much more exciting it is when you comment. We have a give and take. Unless a disaster happens, I'll see you Tuesday. I love you. I'm sorry.